Hello, this is Jay from Cucumber Shop. Today I am in Sassoon Valley looking at the Carousel Baratiri, Fasano or Cianchufo. It goes by quite a number of names. Um, it was discovered in the early 1900s. Well, the seed was given to a gentleman in the early 1900s uh, from a monk who was a friend of his. And uh, he grew it out and shared it prolifically is a melon that has grown immature as a cucumber and that's the way it's always been grown. Um, apparently uh, a lot of Italians feel like this is the very best car Caracello variety or cucumber melon variety, meloncella. Um, anyways, uh, round, uh, doesn't slip from the vine necessarily and uh, has a really good texture. Um, well into later on. I have a major issue in this area with cucumber beetles. So I'll take care of that one. Yeah, okay. Let's keep going. Here's some more younger ones. These are really good. I know you can pick them when they're larger. Um, <clears throat> Unless your plants are super healthy, I probably wouldn't do that. Um, probably wait till later. See here, I have plants under stress from these cucumber beetles. I've uh, picked out about 153 or so of these things from off my plants. These are regular cucumbers. Maybe I'll make a video about them later if I can actually get enough to produce. I can keep the cucumber beetles off them. There's another cucumber beetle. Boy, those things, they're fast. Uh, this poor melon has a lot of scarring on it from the cucumber beetles. We'll look at some of them. Uh, this one's just starting to fruit. And I didn't find so many cucumber beetles under here. Possibly because I have a little toad. That was over here and I decided I would take some um, gourds that had grown over here and I made a little home for the toad. So the little toad's in there. We'll just leave him in there. I'm not going to disturb him. I want him to stay and eat up all my cucumber beetles and everything else. So I'll just leave him alone. This is what the female flower looks like. A lot like other carousel varieties. So, I planted out uh, varieties from multiple cellars, from multiple uh, seed sources, and possibly I may have gotten some from um, a uh, friend of mine as well. I can recall exactly what I got, but. Um, Yeah, and I'm trying um, soapy water uh, in yellow cups, and that seems to be working a lot better uh, than I had some sticky traps. They didn't really seem to be working, but the soapy water is working quite well um, in yellow cups. So I'll just stick with that. There's another female flower right there. You might be able to hear a tractor in the distance. I don't know if you can hear that. I'm in an agricultural area. There's olive trees here. This is an olive orchard. There's a vineyard over there. This poor plant. 
So you can see some cucumber beetle beetles in there. Met their doom in that soapy water. There's the original one. And uh, just take a look real quick at these. The whole plot. Well, that's about it for today. This is Jay with Cucumber Shop, looking at the Baratiri or Fasano. Um, see on Chufo as well from Cucumber Shop. If you have any questions, just let me know and happy gardening.